it's playing the right notes this time. So, the sensor is playing perfectly. The piano is playing perfectly. I'm happy. And, on top of that, on the inside has a wood soundboard, which I put together. I used the original speaker, um, Fabric and the Grills, for that. It sounds beautiful. because it's a digital piano and it's a hybrid. It's basically a hybrid grand piano. It has a real grand piano action. As you can see, the keys are wood. And it's a nice, big, humongous luxury apartment. So I don't want to bother the neighbors. I can put my headphones on and still play at a piano, you know? It's fast, you gotta, you gotta listen to this. Before it gets to my house, I have to put my tracks on there. Just upload a lot of my stuff on there and it'll be perfect. Now, this is, as I said, this one's gonna go to the apartment. I already have one for the house. It's my DC3. Yeah, so my DC3 right over here, this is for the house. It's a little bit bigger. I don't want too much of a big piano in my room, so this one stays here at the house, and I'm going to be mostly at the house more, but um, the DGT7 is going to be at the apartment, and um, it's going to be really, really cool because that's going to be like my getaway chill-out area. I'm going to spend more time with my sister, and I have a piano over there in my bedroom, which is very, very nice, and any time that I need to use it, I can easily just go and get it you know, for a gig or whatever, but it's really good, doesn't need any tuning, um, it could be silent, which is really neat, and I'm happy with it, I'm very, very happy with it. Alright everybody, so just wanted to show you, let's play one more song, just to give it a test. So let's try Honeysuckle Rolls, and right over here, Honeysuckle Rolls. So it's low right now, but the volume is right over here. And I can add reverb. Turn it down. So, see, 
See, that's what's versatile about a Yamaha piano, especially a disco bear. And this one right over here, it does the same thing, but this is more of the acoustic version plus the hybrid. So it has digital and acoustic on it. I can sh shut off the hammers and have it. So I got two disco bears. So this one's for the apartment. That one's for the house. And I got my nine foot closet ran over there. And I got my William Symphony ran right there. So, when I first got this piano, um, I was going to say, the, the key sensor was not working, and I made videos on that, so it, took, it cost me um, around $500 to replace the key sensor, and then after that, the, um, the chip for the uh, player was not working, so it cost me another $200 to replace the chip. So... It's no problem. As I said, I traded my Busendorf for 7-footer for this piano, and now it's working perfectly. On top of that, another thing that I did is I, underneath there, I don't know if you can see it, but that's more Disclavier piano parts from another Disclavier that I got off of eBay. So that, plus all the other um, parts that I had to get, by the way, that part was that part was another four hundred dollars. Um, it saved this piano. It saved this piano, so I'm so happy that this is working perfectly. And I could I could sit back in my apartment and let the piano play by itself, you know, and and drink some tea. I love to drink some tea, everybody. <laughs> some homemade hibiscus with rose petals tea, which is really good. Like it's working perfectly and another thing that's going with the piano let me show you is this lovely lady right over here she's gonna be sitting right on top of the piano I should have put her up there for the video but it's okay all right I'll see you guys bye bye